Hey guys and gals, welcome today to the unboxing of the Assassin's Creed Unity and Assassin's Creed Rogue launch kit or GameStop launch kit. Uh, first off on top here, uh, Assassin's Creed lanyard. I noticed they, they went with just Assassin's Creed in the regular Assassin's logo um, because obviously they are doing two games so they didn't want to put a Rogue logo or a Unity logo because it's for both. Um, so here you have the uh, lanyard card which says ask me about asset more about assassin's creed unity rogue and then again a regular symbol here instead of using the the either guillotine cut one or the broken shattered one for rogue um and this is actually much bigger than most lanyard cards this thing is massive i mean you see it's almost yeah it's like the size of my hand it's huge um then on the back you just have stuff about the season pass and the phantom blade all right so we'll set that over here um, and then next you have this, this, uh, folder, which is actually really nice. It's actually got the uh, Assassin's Creed logo is embossed on the top. And again, it's the regular logo. It actually sticks up a little bit. I don't know if you can, can't really tell. You'll be able to see in a second when I open it up on the back. It's just plain except for the Ubisoft logo and the, the legal stuff on the bottom there. Oh, if we can get it to focus. There you go. All right. So we'll open it up. And then first over here. You have these, uh, you know, uh, thicker gauge paper, and then this one looks exactly like the uh, the lanyard card, with the same stuff on the back. Actually, I think except for this. Okay, uh, so we'll set that over here. Oh, let's put it over here. And then here you have basically the same exact sheet, except there's like a little note to the GameStop manager. Just tell them to keep it handy and. Yeah, same exact sheet, just with a little info on there for the manager. And then over here, you have a letter to the GameStop employees or manager. Let's see, I'll take it all out at the same time. And there's a lot of other sheets here that I'm going to go through. Um, so you have, like, you know, the letter they usually send. And this is on, some like, a really thin gauge paper. Almost like a magazine-type paper. So, and then you look... On the bottom looks to be, I'm guessing, Paris. Or, yeah. Fran France or somewhere in France. Alright, so uh, that's basically just detailing all the stuff. I'm sure you guys had time to read that. Oh, okay, actually, hold on. I didn't notice this until I just went to set that sheet over there. It is actually the same exact sheet, except there's like a post-it on it. I actually did not even notice that. I thought it was an actual part of the paper when I first saw it. Neat. Okay, so... Um, okay, so here you have Assassin's Creed Unity, a little sheet for that, and then, the, oh, probably stuff on the back. Yes, of course there is. Okay, so make history, some images from the game, and some, uh, well, I don't know if you guys could read that. And I'll kind of go slow here, so you guys can pause it and read it if you want to. Oh, and then on the bottom, it's talking about the uh, bonus offers, the spin to win, chemical revolution, and GameStop exclusive weapon. And then you have Rogue. And the same thing on the back here. Just telling you about when it takes place, who you're going to be playing as, some uh, game screenshots. And again, the pre-order bonus is at the bottom there. All right, and then the Phantom Blade, the replica there. Probably trying, they were trying to push a lot, or at least they wanted them wanted them to try to push it a lot. I'm sure. All right, and then the season pass, which from the picture I imagine is going to be two new assassins. Unity. Save 30%. Eight hours of new content. I think a lot of people have been clamoring to to play as her because um, in the Assassin's Creed Revelations, oh, I guess I forgot to put that over there. Assassin's Creed Revelations, they had that thing where uh, 
you she came to Ezio, you know, for advice and training. Uh, see here, you can see how it's embossed on the other side, so that's pretty cool. And then here's like a little slot. I'm actually not sure if that's like the lanyard card would go down in there. I tried it early; it fits pretty good, so that might be for that. Well, all right, guys and gals, that was the Assassin's Creed Unity and Rogue GameStop launch kit. Hope you guys enjoyed the unboxing. Uh, yeah, I'll keep them coming. All right, again, thanks for watching.